Welcome back to PT. This is Mark with Gamers Don't Play. And it is midnight. Zero, zero, zero. Hey, Brisby. Um, something's missing. Okay, so normally during this part of the game, the radio is playing like a Swedish, I think it's Swedish. Uh, sort of disc jockey talking about aliens, if I'm not mistaken. I don't know why, you know, maybe it's a glitch, but it's it's not playing. Um, there are plenty of YouTubers out there that were able to capture that, so I would, you know, if you're trying to recreate the game. By the way, somebody did recreate this game a little bit. Um, very well with the hallway, not so well with Lisa herself. But... Um, like when you look at the paintings and the pictures and stuff like that, perfectly recreated. Uh, it, it's a game called Punity, and it was made in Unity. And the P and the T are capitalized. I mean, it really makes no secret of what it's trying to do, like... But instead of looping through the hallway, you just walk back and forth and then get attacked by Lisa and then the game ends. Okay, so here we are in what is most definitively Guillermo del Toro's part of the game where the eyeballs are rolling around and whatnot. You also move significantly faster. And if you continue to move, you will just loop and loop and loop forever. So I'll just demonstrate that. There we are at the beginning again. All right, so you do that, you'll, you'll just go forever. There's the hole, but no eyeball. Alright, so we will find our way out of here soon enough. What you're ultimately looking for is a painting that fell down. There it is. Now you look where it was. Okay, I hope you saw that. No turning back now. You got fired, so you drowned your sorrows in booze. She had to get a part-time job working a grocery store cash register. Only reason she could earn a wage at all is the manager liked how she looked in a skirt. You remember, right? Exactly ten months back. So this is the point of the game where I realize that my character 
the character I'm playing is in his own personal hell. Uh, there are theories that he murdered his wife because she was pregnant with the grocery store manager's son or daughter or whatever. Uh, the fetus is that particular fetus, of course. Um, it's very dark, but yeah, this is... Um, I mean, it's very much up to interpretation. But it's definitely... This, you know, the character that you're playing has definitely caused his own hell. And he probably was the father in that story that the radio was talking about. And I'm guessing Lisa was his wife. Now this part, yeah, there you go. This part's also randomized. Um, it'll give you a random message. Like, uh, fix the bug in this game, or I'll call you tomorrow, stuff like that. A lot of different languages. Uh, Kojima really wanted this game to take weeks to solve. It took less than a day, thanks to Soapy Warpig. Amazing video, by the way. Eight, six, three. Two, zero, four, eight, six, three. Check it out. Two, zero, four, eight, six, three. Two, zero, four, eight, six, three. Two, zero, four, eight. Yeah, so um, that's not the end of the game. Uh, we'll have one or two more videos. Hopefully just one, because I don't want this to go on forever. Um, yep, there it is from the beginning of the game. And a lot of people thought that this was the ending. But it's not. I will see you next time, folks.